Hi, I'm Kristen Tenpenny, and I'm going to teach you how to trace all of your meridians so that you can do them on a daily basis to promote well-being. And the meridians are pathways through your entire body so your entire body can communicate with your organs as well as your brain. It begins at the central meridian and you start at the pubic bone and you trace up the center and you end at the bottom lip. Okay, and the next one is the governing meridian and you start at the bottom, the base, and you go up the back and you make a connection between your fingers and then come around the top of your head and end at the top of your lip. And if you can't make that connection, then just imagine it. The next one is the spleen meridian and you start at the big toe and you trace up the front of your body and then you go up through your heart and then up to the armpits and then down next to the chest. Then next is the heart meridian. So you start at the armpit and you go down to the front of the pinky. And then you do the other arm as well. Next is the small intestine meridian and you start on the other side of the pinky. You come up and then you go around the back to the shoulder blades and then you come up around your neck. around. Okay, and you also Repeat it on the other side. Okay. okay, next is the bladder meridian. So you start in between your eyes. You go around the top of your head, down the center. And, come, and you meet your hand. Go around kind of the side of your spine. And then you, you um, go up and down the hip line. And then go down and then around your buttocks and then you come back around and meet your hand again and go down the center of your spine and then you go all the way down the back of your legs until you get to your pinky toe okay next is the kidney meridian and you start at the bottom of your feet so you touch there and then you come up and you go around your ankles make a little circle and then you come up the sides of your inner thighs and legs and then you come up tight around your stomach and you come up through the chest and then you meet up right beneath the collarbone right here. Okay, next is the circulation meridian and you start on the side of the breast and you come down the inside of your hand and you go out the middle finger and you do both sides. And next is the triple warmer meridian, and you start on the other side of the middle finger on the outside, and then you come up around the shoulder, up the neck, around the back of the ear, and to the temple, and you do both sides. Okay, next is the gallbladder meridian. Start at the side of your eyes, go to your ears, then go up one inch, make a circle, and then go around your ears, all the way to the back of your head, the skull, where the skull meets the neck, and then go up and meeting at the very center of your head, the forehead, and then go back down the center of your head, and then to the shoulders, and then you come around and meet both shoulders down, and then when you get to the center of your um, rib cage, come down and make a little divot, and then come back down to your hips and you're gonna go down and then you get to the calf and you make another one of those divots you come back down and then you go out the fourth toe okay. okay next is the liver meridian start at your big toe come up the side inner thigh and then go to your hips up the side body and then when you get to your chest come back around underneath your breasts. Okay, next is the lung meridian. So you start on top of your lung. You use your hand to push up, come out onto your arm and to the thumb. And you do both sides. Okay, so next is the large intestine meridian. So you start with your pointer finger and you go up your arm and then up the neck and to the, the nostril. You do both both sides. Okay, the last meridian is the stomach meridian. 
You start with your fingertips underneath your eyes, and then you make a circular motion around your head, and then you come down across your face, meeting at the neck, down the neck, and when you get to your collarbone, come out, and then down the chest, meeting a little closer to the center of your uh, mid-body, and then out to the hips, and then going down the front and out the second toe. And that's it! You trace all of your meridians. So you can trace them and if you don't feel any movement or inner, any energy like being excelled and feeling better after this, then you may have some of them blocked. And blocking is another process that you would have to get it flushed out. And I can do that on Skype or phone sessions if you would like for me to do that with you. Uh, my website is www.kristentenpenny.com. And thank you.